Heyo guys, what's up? It's me, Fangbanger. In this video, I'm bringing you another FIFA 13 Ultimate Team that is girl style. And in this video, I'm going to be bringing you a team I made that I would have to say is pretty much absolute shit. I don't even know why I decided to make them. Maybe other people have used them and they might not think they're absolute shit. You might actually be really good at using this team. This might be your formation. This might be your league. But for me, it was just a frustrating terrible team but I still wanted to show you the team build because maybe I don't know maybe you can do something amazing with them I couldn't as you can see I've got some guys out of formation I have some guys out of position possibly that could have made me play better but I seem to just have some issues anyway this is a um, Saudi pro league team I think is that I think that's what they call it the Saudi let's check this out Saudi pro league I was correct wow first time's a charm 41212 not my favorite formation uh, the guys here are mostly silver cards. I've got one bronze card, as you can see. Let's take a look at the team a little bit. We've got, are you ready for this? It's time for the name butchering because I have no idea how to say half these guys' names. We've got Nasir Al Shamrani. Um, this guy, 83 pace. That's why I picked him up because, you know, there wasn't a whole lot of pace going on in this league. They are silver cards. 83 pace was looking good for a striker, which is pretty pathetic in my mind because I would love to have some 90 pace strikers. I look for the 80s and, you know, the 70s possibly in the midfield. But I got 83 pace here, 74 shot. You know, he was probably maybe one of the more all right players on the team. And then over at the right side striker position, I got Ahmad Alhansi or Hosni. Jeez. And to be honest, like, um, if you're from Saudi Arabia or maybe just you're from that area, and you happen to know, like, why it might, maybe it has something to do with, like, their religion or whatever they do. But they, you see that Al is in front of everything. Like, every team name, let me go to the team name. It's like Al, Ali, you know, like they have A-L in front of everything. I don't know. I just kind of wanted to know the answer to that. But anyway, terrible player. He's not any good. He gets freaking just eaten up. He gets swallowed up whenever he's trying to make runs. It's just ridiculous. And then I spent, yes. 16,000 coins of wastefulness on this player right here, Elton Jose Xavier Gomez. And Elton, who kind of looks like Elton John, to be honest. Maybe a Brazilian Elton John, just kidding. He is terrible. He's a five-star skiller. Maybe that's why he was that expensive, but he's only 5'3", and he's not even that quick. His, accelerate, or his acceleration is just like, oh my god, so terrible. And he was just not a good player for me. I could not do anything with him. I think I scored maybe one goal with him, and I expected just great things to come out of him. It was just not good. Um, I picked up a left wing to go in the left mid position. Probably not a good idea, but he had 87 pace, and I needed something because I was getting beat up on this guy's name. Abdel Ghani Fauzi. I don't know. I, got, I think that was pretty close. Four-star skill moves, three-star weak foot. Don't have very much to say about him. Right mid position. Hamad al Hamad. <laughs> He's got the same name, the same first and last name. I just noticed that. Hamad Al Hamad. Another 87 pace. You'd think, you know, that's going to do something. 71 dribble. Okay shot. Nope. Not a hollow gun on there as well. And there was a one guy that I could have got at center defensive mid position that would have been in formation. But I was like, no, I got to get this guy here. He's 76 pace. He's got 68 defense. He's going to be such a great player. 70 shot. Oh my gosh. What is his name? Hosni Abed Rabo Ami. Don't, I don't even know. Hosni. That's what we're going to call him. Five foot nine. He was all right. Didn't really do that much for me. Left back, we have here. Abdullah Shuhal. 88 pace, really fast left back. He is a five-star weak foot, but I never, ever got anywhere near the goal with him to even try to shoot. And he's got a 46 shot anyway, so who cares about his weak foot? Um, and then we've got here Majid Al-Marshadi. My center back, left side, 63 pace, 19 shot. Oh, my God. What if? Could you imagine if I tried to take a shot with him? It would probably just, like, I could be, like, probably right there. The goalie or the keeper not even in the net. Try to take a shot with him, and it would just, like, fly over. Who knows? But six foot tall, so figured he'd be great for defending. And he had 79 heading. Um, and then my right side center back, Osama Al-Mawalid. Mawalid. Uh, Osama here is three-star weak foot, two-star skill moves, 5'11", 77 heading. That's another one. You know, they were okay on defense, but not, like, amazing. My keeper, let me just get to that guy in a second. My right back position, Hazan Muath. I got him because he's 90 pace. I figured that was going to do something for me, and really it didn't. I pretty much got burned the entire time, but he is six foot. He has 
you know, not very good heading though. So he's not going to stop any of the, what I consider the worst goal in the game, which has become down to just the only time I get scored on. And it's like the 45th and the 90th minute uh, when they get the corner kick and they cross it and the guy heads it in. My guys can never stop it. And then at my goalie, my keeper position, we've got Walid Abdullah, who I also spent a pretty okay amount of coins on, like 2,800 coins. And he is six foot five, and he's got 71 diving, 76 reflexes, 61 hands of pure shit. Abdullah is sh shit. He lets everything go by me. So terrible. It's ridiculous. I am probably still so mad. I lost, like, I think it was like seven or eight games. I had an okay record. A pretty okay record until I played with this team last night and it was all in a row and it was like I'd be winning by like two and then out of nowhere they would just stop. They would stop. They were literally the players that would stop and just stare while a guy was going to score and you're trying to switch to him. You're like, ah, switch to the guy and he won't switch to him. I don't know what's going on with FIFA, but it won't switch to the guy. So just it was just epic frustration. You will see what came out of this team. Good things happen because of this team that I'm about to sell as quickly as I make this video and that is I'm decided to get so mad and I raged so hard after losing that many times that I made this beautiful team that's worth like 300 and something thousand coins of awesomeness and it's a BPL team and that will come in future videos. I still have to bring you the Stone Cold Stunners. I just don't know why but I keep forgetting to play with them or I don't play with them so I need to do that. They're probably going to be just as hard to score goals with because they're like 56 chemistry, bunch of bald guys. But yeah, this is a three star team of just pure shit. But I mean, you want to try it. If you think that you have it in you and you can actually win with this team and you want to rub it in my face, I dare you to do it. I decided to name them Alibaba, by the way. They're Saudi Arabian League team or whatever. Not all of them are from there. But uh, whenever I think of Saudi Arabia, I think of like Arabian Nights. And then I think of like Aladdin. And so I think like in Aladdin, they like were in Alibaba or I don't even know. That's pretty nerdy, but that's what I decided to name the team. I do have some goals from them, though. I did score goals, surprisingly. I scored some goals with them, so I'm going to show you those goals. Check them out. Let me know what you think. Yeah. I know you're feeling this, right? This is dedication to all you haters out there. Saudi's rap king, man. Representing myself. Coming from Medina. And shooting like Hurricane Katrina. Yeah. guys well that was Alibaba I will never play with this team again nor will I ever get close to making a team anywhere near this league ever again they are just not made for me they might be made for you I did not play with them in stream but I do play with a lot of my teams in stream so you guys need to stop by my stream it is a definite must check me out it's www.twitch.tv slash fang underscore i3 anger I'm so random at streaming so if you want to know when it's going to happen just definitely check me out on twitter maybe give me a little ask on twitter um, at fang underscore i3 anger and this is it for this video frustration building I've got a new team coming for you just wait also, another building, Bill Compton, should be coming out soon. Hopefully, I can work on one this weekend. It takes a lot more to put into that video because of the stuff I have to do for it, the editing. But uh, until next time, get fangbangers.